Hello friends, I am Dr. Anurag Gupta and today I will show you how to use ultrasound for brachial plexus block. For an effective block, first make the patient lie down supine. Second, ask him to look to the opposite side. Third step is to make the patient propped up 35 to 45 degrees. Fourthly, push the pillow to the opposite side so that you get space to cite the injection. Now coming to the choice of probe for supraclavicular block. We need a linear probe in this case because it gives us an excellent picture of near view nerves. The tips to correctly place the linear probe in a patient whom we intend to give a brachial plexus block is first ask the patient to lift his head number one and see the triangle formed by the sternocleotal border of sternocleidomastoid, the clavicle and the trapezius. In this triangle you have to place your probe as if you are looking into the lung, directing the pointer towards the ipsilateral shoulder. After ascertaining the area, now we are going to put the linear high frequency probe on the supraclavicular area. I am going to look for the visuals in the ultrasound machine. In the ultrasound, we will be seeing or locating the pulsating subclavian artery. That will be our landmark. The pulsating subclavian artery lies above the clavicle. We can see the pulsating subclavian artery and superiorly and laterally to that we can see the bundle of brachial plexus. Thanks for watching my video. video. If you have any queries, you can write down below. I will be happy to answer it. Otherwise, you can like it, subscribe it or share it. Thank you.